Hello there and welcome to this video. I'm going to be showing you how to put up the triple gong stand. Now this triple gong stand is amazing. It's the way I play. I sit and I play. I don't ever sort of stand up because I like to hold the space beautifully. I like to play and not create any disturbances. So the triple gong stand is great. Not only that, it is galvanized so it doesn't create any sort of rust. It will never rust. It will never corrode. Never creak like any other painted uh, stands that you've seen that are probably black or white or any other sort of colours. So it's very, very simple to put together and I'll show you how it's done. So first of all, we want to start off with the two wheels, get the two wheels. And you want to line up together and then you want the centre pole for those wheels and basically connect them together. And it's very fast to put together. I love this gong stand. I'm not much of a fan of uh, the square stands just because they're a bit more harder to sort of put up. So let's turn around so you can see. Let's place it about there. Next thing what you want to do is you want to get the two long uh, parts and you want to make sure that the screw is on the side. Like so. And then the second one on the side. And then at this point, don't do them up too tight. You want the centre bar where you hang uh, the gong, the centre gong, up to 42 inches, which is really good. In there, so it locks. Then these top ones you can do up, then turn it around, which I find easier. And on the sides, these are part of the sides arms which uh, help reinforce uh, the gongs uh, for the weight. Now, you want to put one in the bottom leg, like so, make sure it's a bit loose, and then the other one on the side. Now the wheel's still locked into place, it's important to put like a rug down or a um, blanket when you're doing this, especially on like nanite floors or painted white floors or anything because you don't want anything to sort of um, um, sort of scratch. Then you do the same, you get the, the second side arm, the reinforcement, get the other two bolts and you do exactly the same. So put it through the back, Just like so. And you probably can't see this very well at the angle that you're watching, but uh, when you come to do it yourself, it's very, very simple. Just doing that completely. And then you want the two side arms, which hold the uh, side gongs. And you basically just uh, put these on the sides and do them up, lift it into place. So you, as you can see, it's not very heavy at all. And then the final one on the side itself. And there you have it. Lock the wheels and then I'll show you how to put on the gong. It's very, very simple. So here we have a 42 inch water gong from Turn of Life, same manufacturer that uh, creates the stand. Then put on the uh, She Moon, which is 30 inch. So these side arms hold up to a, uh, a 32 either side. And then I have another 30 inch, which is the Earth Gong on the left arm. So we have, so this is why the, the stand is at a certain height and it creates a, a lovely vortex where you can sit and, and play.